All right, guys, let's solve this SAT problem. So here, 8 will reduce it to 2 to the power of 3 to the power of this x equal to, we'll leave this one with, uh, let's just repeat the way it is, minus this 2, this particular form will be reduced to 2 to the power of 2 to the power of 26, all divided by 30. What will be the next step? Very simple. 3 times x will give us 3x equals, here we have 2 to the power of 56 minus 2 to the power of 2 by 26 will give us 52. So we have 52 here. If you see that we have 2 to the power of 52, here is 2 to the power of 52. We have it inside of this 2 to the power of 56. That means 2 to the power of 52 is common to both sides. So what we need to do is to factor out 2 to the power of 52. So if you pull out 2 to the power of 52, what will be left is 2 to the power of 4. After all, 52 plus 4 will give you 56. These two debates, they are common. Then if you pull out this 2 to the power of 52, 1 will be left divided by 30. So the next thing we want to do at this point is to say 2 to the power of 52 into 2 to the power of 4 will give us 16. 16 minus 1, that will be 15. So we have 15 divided by 30. The next point is to reduce this 1 into your 2. So we have 2 to the power of 3x equal to 2 to the power of 52 uh, divided by 2 to the power of 1. According to the division law of indices, when the bases are the same, what you need to do is to take the common base and subtract the power. So on the left hand side, we have 2 to the power of 3x equal to 2 to the power of 51. When the bases are the same, equate the power. So we have 3 to the power of 3x equal to 51. We divide both sides by 3. 3 cancels out. Therefore, x will be equal to 3 into 51 will be 17. So that is the answer. I hope you found this video helpful. Please like this video, share. And if you need one-on-one -on -one section, hit my DM. Peace and love.